Okay. I don't know if in-game chat will work, so I'm gonna just look in between. Uh, in between little, little times, and uh, we'll see how this. Uh, is there an option for it? No. Okay. Whatever. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Congratulations! Yeah, it, it appears you have been granted access to additional holiday content. Press the special button in the candy pail to enter the Halloween hub. Keep in I don't mind do that this that. DLC pack is nothing more than a festive holiday themed add-on, which has absolutely no hidden intent or purpose. So, have fun. Okay. What is... This? Wait, what does this do? I don't know what it... What? Curse of Drift, oh my god. Curse of Drift, man. Is the sound all good and everything? Or is the sa The sound feels like it's too loud. I'll have it like... There. Okay, that's 13.3 decibels. There we go. Oh, Christ. I tabbed out of uh, the stream chat. This is the joys of doing VR for anyone who's uh, never done it before. Okay. Nice. Continue. Continue. Me want to continue. Me want to continue. Me want to continue. Afraid of the dark? What the fucking hell is this? Dude, this is scary. This is a problematic cable as well that's tied to this shit. I don't really see me fucking falling over and strangling myself. Should we do the Halloween one? I mean, it makes sense. I'm not doing corn maze. That seems like a fucking anxiety-driven situation. I feel like I need like 50 feet of space to do this shit. Plushkin patch? What the hell is that? I don't even know how to play the game, so... Flashlight R3? Okay. Oh, that's fucking... What? What the hell is that? Where's the... Dude, this is fucked. Oh, oh. The fuck? Okay. Oh, that's a Freddy Krueger. Oh god, she's horny. What the hell? Ugh. Oh, fucking Christ! Oh my god. Fucking. Ugh. Fuck! Don't look behind you. Damn, that's a cool skin. Dude, he's like 58 feet tall. Let's, let's do the not Halloween one. Let's do the easiest one. Keep the in one mind that this pack is nothing more than a festive holiday themed add-on. Can't even which do a middle finger for this fucking no guy. What the so, hell is this there? Have fun. Oh, what? Turns colors in verse or something? Let's just let's just do the basic basic night. Let's go, boys. I fucking did. I don't want to do this. I want to do the the, the, the frickin' regu. I want to do the regu one. Oh, okay. What the hell? Oh, oh. Oh, I can adjust my height by doing that? Ah, oh, dude, my fucking My body actually hurts from how scary that was. I guess I can just press this again. I should move the mic down, maybe? Is this 
fucking problematic wire, but... Oh my god, dude. Let's just do regular learning how to play. Then I can get not terrified. I don't know if I should put the mic here, this seems... What the fuck? On your first Shut up! He's fucking speaking for a million years. What? Rabo. Dude, this Borny is getting close. Saw you, bitch. <laughs> it's like I was just sliding to my fucking DMs right now. Okay, I think we're good on this side. Go away. Deal. Go away. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh god.
Dude, this is so hard to fucking keep track of all this and not fucking freak out. It's still out there. I can still see you in the shadows, bitch. Fucking duck looking ass. It's still 6 a.m. We need to last. Shit. Let's fucking go, baby! Where's <laughs> oh. he <gasps> Fudge! 250 calories? Jesus Christ. It's like, kinda accurate, it seems like. Can I eat? Dang, that is a good way to get fat. Those things that just disappear in one second of eating them? Fucking hell. They want to see your cock. <laughs> Can I eat more of these? Fucking... Oh, I'm gonna get so fat. This is now a mukbang stream. Hey guys, I'm gonna sit here and eat a fucking billion calories in one sitting. I want you to do fat guy VR where you just don't move, so. It's kinda. adds to the effect of me eating a million Fazbear bars. 1.5. Damn, those are 108 cows? Dude, we've just eaten like 5,000 calories. This is awesome. I don't know if I'll do more than two nights on each one, because uh, it just seems like you kind of get the gist. I feel like night one is like the tutorial, night two you kind of get the gist, and then it just gets like incrementally harder. So maybe, because how many games are in this? Oh god. Should we do all these like mini games and stuff as well? I guess we could do one, two, then maybe go one, two, one, two. Uh, I don't know about these. These are like the mini games, I guess. But um, yeah, we'll do another one in this. Then we'll do two, three, and maybe some mini games. We'll do like two games each. I think that'll be kind of a good idea. Let me try and fix this microphone. I need to like hang it upside down or something. I think the mic's good though. If I just speak like this from over here, I think it's still fine. I really should just use like the headset mic, but at the same time, eh. I kind of wish this could get moved forwards. Shut up! It's a G mod missing texture. Shut up! Shut up! Hello! Shut up! Operator, shut up! Shut up! <laughs> Damn, now I got Stockholm syndrome. I kind of miss him. Ugh. Oh, 
Oh god, that was weird. It moved as soon as I looked. I feel like you just check these four and you're all good. So it's coming down there. Booney. Damn, you didn't speak for 15 hours now? Uh, that's Fredo. Bonnets out there. Not out there just yet. We'll keep an eye. Oh shit. What? Okay, bonnets kind of chilling. Still chilling. <laughs> oh shit. Great, that's that's awesome. Glad you're still out there. <laughs> the way they look at you is so fucking stupid. <laughs> Hi there! Fucking nuts. Are you still out? Okay. Oh god. There's Foxy the Furry out there. I'm like an MLG fucking player at this now. I am so focused in. I'd be amazing at not dying in a horror movie. Like how they walk next to you. To oh fuck, dude, this is fucked. Oh great. Oh shit. Shit, 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 shit. Is actually an MLG Freddy player. Dang, it's my god given talent. Markiplier ain't got shell me, baby. It's actually kind of cool. I kind of want this. Should we just do the full first game? Should we do every game? I feel like once I've got it to this point, we're kind of good. Like, we kind of get the mechanics down, right? I don't think there's anything major that changes, but I don't know, I'm, I'm down to, uh, to try. To 
try the shies. Oh, this is... Oh, this is like the bonus night? Also, is this caught on anything? Jam my hand into a piece of metal to get this to work. Everything's sort of off center in this game as well. It does not help the frickin' situation, to be honest. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. It's like a night sky effect over there. Wait, what? Why did it recenter? Oh, so we got a half-life noise. What the hell? Oh, I can just do that. I need to recenter this thing though. I should recenter it over here a bit. Oh, great. Dude, that's so funny. <laughs> what? Check these two and you'll be all good. Dude, I do not have long enough reach for this game. You need to be at least seven foot two. Oh shit. That means it's gonna run, right? If he sticks out the curtain like that? Means pretty much you're gonna be circumcised real soon. Oh yeah, there we go. So it feels like everything is just going wrong for me over there. Can you just run, please? You fucking asshole. Okay, that's his. They're like 55 feet tall, it's fucking scary. Oh god. Are they on both sides doing this shit? Okay, we'll keep out the lookout for Bonner. coming back. Well, Foxo. Foxo not coming back. Bono looking at me. Ducko looking at me. But not quite. Gr 
right there on either side. I think we're good. No, we are not. We are still not there as well. Kissing this wire right now. It's my key to salvation. Okay. Oh shit. Dude, what time is it? What time is it? Fuck. I hate this. 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 Gold coin? What? Damn. My fucking dad. I'm oh my god! I hate you! I fucking hate you! Dude, they shake you and it makes you go fucking. It's fucking seizure simulator. Jesus Christ. How do you not get paid enough to do this shit, man? It's not worth it. It's not freaking worth it. I'm going tonight. I'm going to game two. Game two. I can only handle so much of this shit. <laughs> I want it so it's easy enough I can do it, okay? And I don't have to try 55 fucking times. Also, if I change games... <clears throat> sorry, I'm just gonna eat fat quickly. Oh, fuck. Oh, gotta get the calories. Oh, gotta bulk. Oh, oh fuck. Okay, uh... <laughs> and this means... It'll be more scary because I won't know what's happening. Uh, see, see. Oh my god, dude. My fucking ribs hurt. It feels like I've been electrocuted. What the hell is that? It looks like there was a screwdriver or something there. Fucking shit down there. <sighs> sure wouldn't hurt like what wouldn't hurt <laughs> it wouldn't hurt to move this fucking wire out of the way I can tell you that much well he gets 20 years of adrenaline now that he didn't get before <laughs> you know right it's fucking terrifying. You see, there's like... There's certain levels of fear. There's like going into a war zone, knowing you probably won't make it out. And that that's like here. And then there's playing Five Nights at Freddy's VR, which is like here. It's like at least double. You have to be twice as brave to do that. Uh... <laughs> so anyway... Let's continue. Um, you know, like... <laughs> it's, uh, it's a spooky game. Oh, look, this one's actually a good... I can actually deal with this. This layout's way better. Hello? Hello? Dude, I can't hear you. Dude. Hello? Is this working? Uh, Hello? Some of the things you can expect to see during your first week here to help you get started down this new oh, and exciting awesome. career path. Uh, now, I want you to forget anything you may have heard about the old location, you know. Okay. Uh, some people still have Already a somewhat done. negative impression of the company. Uh, that old restaurant oh. was kind of left to rot for quite a while, but uh, I want to reassure you Fazbear Entertainment is committed to family fun and above all, safety. They've spent a small fortune on these new animatronics. Uh, facial recognition, advanced... They look 
the place is scary for sure. Let them walk around during the day. Isn't that neat? But most importantly, they're all tied into some kind of criminal database so they can detect a predator a mile away. Hey, we should be paying them to guard you. Uh, now that being said, no new system is without its kinks. Uh, Kinky. You're only the second guard to work at that location. Damn, this game looks uh, the way better than the first one. Complained about conditions. Uh, we switched him over to the day shift. So, hey, look at this, right? That uh, mainly he expressed to oh, the fuck. character seeks to move around at night oh, shit. and even attempted to get into his office. Now, from what we know, that should be impossible. Uh, that restaurant should be the safest place on Earth. So, while our engineers don't really have an explanation for this, the working theory is that the robots were never given a proper night. Uh. So, when it gets quiet, they think they're in the wrong room. So then they go try to find where the people are, and in this case, that's your office. Dude, what the fuck is so he even talking about? My ADD will not let me focus in on that. And it's rigged to be wound up remotely. So just every once in a while, switch over to the prize counter video feed and wind it up for a few seconds. It doesn't seem uh -huh. to affect all of the animatronics, uh -huh. but it does affect one of them. Oh, I see. Uh, and as for the rest of them, we have an even easier solution. You see, there may be a minor glitch in the system. Something about robots think he was an endoskeleton without his costume on and wanting to stuff you in the suit. So hey, we've given you an empty Freddy Fazbear head. Problem solved. You can put it on any time and leave it on for as long as you want. Eventually, anything that wandered in will wander back out. Uh, something else worth mentioning is kind of the quirky modern design of the building. You may have noticed there are no oh. doors for you to close. <laughs> Uh, but hey, you have a life, and even though your flashlight can run out of power, the building cannot. So don't worry about the place going dark. Well, I think that's it. Uh, you should be golden. Uh, check the lights, put on the Freddy head if you need to. Uh, keep the music box wound up. Feed the cake. Have a good night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. No one knew who I was till I put on the mask. I don't know why I have to crank this. Oh, dude, this is my fucking jam. Mm, 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 mm. Fuck yes. It's like just an all time fucking banger. Remix. Remix, baby. Hello, rabbit. Oh, shit. Oh my god, she's got no nose. That's epic. It's weird not closing the uh, frickin' doors. Sounds like a really rusty robot jerking off. <laughs> Fucking slam it through the table. Dude, I definitely like this one more than the first one. If I was gonna complete one, I'd definitely complete this. I think this one's definitely uh, made better. Like the layout of all this shit is so much better than just like the actual uh, like stuff you can do. It feels way better. But we made it, baby. Six A to the motherfucking M. Salted and un no dated, an unoriginal disappointment. Boring, mild, passable. 
850 calories? Are you tired of intrusive flavor and texture in your food? Do you ever eat a home-cooked meal and feel silent dread? Well, boy, do we have a snack for you. Disappointment is neither new nor exciting, nor a single remarkable flavor will intrude on your food experience. Wow, take a somber, unfulfilled breath of relief as you take a bite out of disappointment. This snack is not great, it's not even good. It is boring, mild, passable. Dang, this is a, oh my god, is this 300% of your saturated fat it is? 850 calories. Oh, dude, I feel so good now. Oh, yes. Oh, oh. Then again, I am working a job that like an 800 pound person would work. I don't know, so it does make sense that, like, eating all this candy. Because, I mean, what else am I going to do? What, other than Twitch stream? <laughs> That's the only, uh, 800 pound person maneuver you could pull. Oh! Oh, I can... I press trigger and it goes across. This is definitely a sound from, like, Portal. Whatever. Okay. Just rereading shit. Hello? Uh, hello? Hello? Uh, hey, I told you your first night wouldn't be a problem. You're a natural. Uh, by now I'm sure you've noticed the older models sitting in the back room. Uh, those are from the previous locations, and we just use them for parts now. The idea at first was to repair them. Uh, they even started retrofitting them with some of the newer technology. But they were just so ugly, you know? And the smell. Uh, the uh, smell? What? So the company decided to just go in a whole new direction and make them super kid-friendly. Uh, the older ones shouldn't be able to walk around. But if they do, the whole Freddy head trick should work on them too, so what oh, should work on them, that's uh, great. I love Good one, Manai. Uh, did you ever see Foxy Hello. the Pirate? Oh wait, Foxy. Oh yeah, Foxy. Uh, hey listen, uh, that one was always mm -hmm. a bit twitchy. Uh, I'm not sure if the Freddy head trick will work on Foxy. Uh, if for some reason if he activates during the night, mm -hmm. and you see him standing at the far end of the hall, uh, just flash your light at him from time to time. Those older models would always get disoriented with bright light. It would call the system restart or something. Uh, I'm gonna think of it. You might want to try that on any room where something undesirable might be. It might hold in the plate for a few seconds. Oh, I can put a light on in the room. One more thing. Don't forget the music box. I'll be honest. I never liked that puppet thing. It's always what the fuck? Thinking mango. I can go anywhere. Uh, I don't think the Freddy mask will fool it. So just don't forget the music box. Um, anyway, I'm sure it won't be a problem. Uh, have a good night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Dude, the way it fucking scares you in this game, I know I said it like last time it happened, but it fucking sucks. They shake you from side to side and it feels like you're being electrocuted. Hello. Oh, hi. <laughs> Me a bear. Me a bear. Fuck. Hi. Shit. Fucking die of seizure. I'm good. Me bear. Me bear. Me bear. I can see him. I can see him through the fucking mask. 
Oh, okay. She wants to suck my deek. Is he just gonna fucking stay there all night? Coming, bitch. I mean, grr, me bear. Uh oh. Oh no, okay. It's heading out. There's definitely more going on than this. This is like. My ADD definitely requires this much stimulation. I'm not saying it'll handle it well, but it definitely requires it. <laughs> Laugh at me, bitch. <laughs> me bad. Me bad. Me bad. Me bad. Bear win. Bear winning, baby. Yeah, dude. Ah, yeah. Fucking. Fucking sniff it. How's this? Butter for one. 850 calories. Boom, bitch. Straight to my uh, cellulite. We went to great lengths to create an authentic VR experience, including using <coughs> scanned photographs for reference. Well, I didn't even have. I hit my controller. Original performance routines where applicable. Dude, this FNAF 2 is so much better than FNAF 1. I'm actually enjoying this one. The first one's kind of. It seems kind of whatever. You guys are, I guess, kind of are technically playing this too. Not only because you're watching me play it, but also you're hearing me smash into the fucking mic every two seconds. It's probably giving you guys a jump scare. Uh, when you deadlift, but your weight is 1,200 pounds. What, me eating all this abundance of candy? Nice to meet you. Uh huh. Oh. Uh huh. Oh, good to know. They tried to remake Foxy, you know. Uh, they thought the first one was too scary, so they redesigned them to be more kid friendly instead of in kids' cove uh, to keep the toddlers entertained, you know. But kids these days just can't keep their hands to themselves. The staff literally had to put Foxy back together at the end of every shift. Eventually they just stopped trying and left him in some kind of take apart, put back together attraction. Mango. Now he's just a mess of parts. I think the employees refer to him as just the mangle. Uh, okay, before I go, uh, I wanted to keep your mind here. about any rumors you might have heard lately. Uh, you know how these local stories come and go and seldom mean anything. I can personally assure you. That whatever is going on out there, however tragic it may be, has nothing to do with our establishment. This all rumor and speculation, people trying to make a buck, you know. Uh, our guard during the day has reported nothing that needs, and he's on watch from opening till close. Okay, well anyway, hang in there and I'll talk with you tomorrow. Okay. chickens there. Oh, you're just gonna walk past, ain't you, bitch? Bono the bitch. Uh.
Me bad. Me bad, baby. Baby, me bad. Don't worry. Oh my god! I got fucking debated. <gasps> Foxy is not easily fooled. Well, my fucking ass is apparently. Jesus Christ. I will say the first one of this seems less no seems more scary than the second one. And whatever the fuck that Halloween thing was, uh that was just goddamn terrifying. I don't know if it's just because I've been scared so many times now, but definitely uh Oh god. Hello? Maybe I should use this oh, in case you try some shit again. Like I said, he was always my favorite. They tried to remake Foxy, you know? Uh, they thought the first one was too scary, so they redesigned him to be more kid-friendly instead of in shit code uh, to keep the toddlers entertained, you know? But kids these days just can't keep their hands to themselves. The staff literally had to put Foxy back together into every ship. Eventually, they just stopped trying and left him as some kind of take apart, put back together attraction. Now he's just a mess of parts. I think the employees refer to him as uh, uh, a mangle. Uh, okay, before I go, uh, I wanted to ease your mind about any rumors you might have heard lately. Uh, you know how these local stories come and go and seldom mean anything. I can personally assure you that whatever is going on out there, however tragic it may be, has nothing to do with our establishment. Um, it's just all rumor and speculation. Sure, bro. People trying to make a buck, you know. Uh, our guard during the day has reported nothing that he's and he's on watch from opening till close. Okay, well, anyway, hang in there and I'll talk with you tomorrow. Fucked. What? Hello, Bono. Fredo is still looking at me like a fucking asshole. I need to take the mask off. Scare me. Why? Why you do this? Why you do this? <sighs> Animatronics can't kill you? Yeah, bullshit. Look at that. There's a fucking human eye sockets coming out of that thing. What do you call that? Fucking assholes. Okay, I'll give this one more go and then we might switch to free. Uh, oh, oh, oh! Yeah, I told you you wouldn't have any problems. Did, uh, Foxy ever repair in the hallway? Probably not. I was just curious. Uh, like I said, he was always my favorite. They tried to remake Foxy, you know? Uh, Shut up. <laughs> have enough of your shit. I was gonna try and fucking spam the hell out of this as much as possible. I swear that was movement, man. Something in here. 
going there. I just need to remember to charge this up a bit more. And then when Fazbo gets there. Uh, not to put the mask on straight away. Third one it is. Foxy is not easily fooled. Well, fuck, neither am I. Ah, oh, fuck. Dude, I can't take that. Oh. I don't know if someone could play this all in one go. That's the problem with horror games. Are you, you having fun them. yet? That's great to hear. I didn't answer, dick face. I would say yes, though. Yes. It's given me the exhilaration I need in my life. Okay, let's go back to easy mode, but night free edition. Also, I just want to point out I've never played any of these games. I have seen these games, I've seen people play them, but I've never actually played them myself. Uh, and I thought VR is like a cool little twist. Oh, this one's layout is terrible. At least for me. That's kind of hey, cool. glad you came back for another night. Hey, but dude. I promise it'll be a lot more interesting this time. Wait, what Got the hell? Some some another night? I haven't even done the first night. Right That's so, uh, terrifying. Then you can get to work. Like the attraction opens in like a week, so we have to make that? sure everything works and nothing catches on fire. Uh, when the place opens, <laughs> people will come in at the opposite end of the building and work their way toward you. Past you and out the exit. Uh, yeah, you've officially become part of the attraction. Uh, you'll be starring as the security guard. So not only will you be monitoring the people on the camera as they pass through, you know, to make sure no one feels it. Yes, I have had the fucking out of the corner, voice slide. You'll also be a part of the show. It'll make it feel really authentic, I think. Uh, I've never really even seen too much of one, it seems like, because I do not know, know what the hell is going on. And the foxy head, which we think could be authentic, then again, it might just be another crappy cosplay. And we found a desk fan, very old school, metal though. You watch the fingers. Dude, uh, I'm confused on what the fuck uh, is he doing. Right now, the place is basically just, you know, flashing lights and spooky props. But I honestly thought we'd have more by now. Uh, we don't have something really cool by next week, so we may have to suit you up in a furry suit and make you walk around saying, boo. <laughs> uh, but, you know, like I'm I said, not doing that. we're trying to track I'm down some good lead right now. Uh, some guy who helped design one of the buildings says it was like an extra room that got No offense, if you'll do that. Something like that. I ain't doing so it. We're going to take a peek. I ain't indulging people. Uh, for now, just get comfortable with your setup. Um, you can check the security cameras over to your right with the click of that blue button. Uh, you can toggle between the hall cams and the bench cams. Oh, that's great. Uh, then can. over to your far left, uh, you can flip up your maintenance panel. You know, use this to reboot any systems that may go offline. <laughs> so in trying to make the place feel vintage, we may have overdone it a bit. <laughs> Some of this equipment is barely functional. No. I wasn't joking about the fire. That's, that's, that's a real risk. The most important thing you want to watch for is the ventilation. Look, this place will give you the spook, man. And if you let what? that ventilation go off wide, then you'll start seeing some crazy stuff, man. Keep that air blowing. Okay, keep an eye on things, and we'll try to have something new for you tomorrow night. I think that's just the better, right? Just reboot all? Surely that's like the pro strat. It does them all at once instead of one at a time. Hi. Dude, how do 
I stop them getting to me in this one? I definitely like two the most. Two seems like the most fun. Well, it is the most fun so far, from what I can tell. They're also bringing out, um... Well, that was weirdly easy. They're also bringing out a newer version of this VR. Like a new, uh, like a second game of this. Where it's going to be all the newer Freddy games. Because this is only 1, 2, and 3. Uh, well, they've got a bunch of extra stuff with it, but they're gonna they're working on doing um, one that is well, that fucking sucks. They're working on one which is um, all the new ones, which I I don't know if I played any of those. Oh god, I think three had the scariest looking thing though. It had um. What's it called? Springtrap or something? That big green moldy guy? Like Freddy but he's been under the sea for 15 years then they fish him up. Hello? Hey man, okay. I have some awesome news for you. First of all, we found some vintage audio training cassettes. Dude, these are like prehistoric. I think they were like training tapes for like other employees or something like that. So, I thought we could, like, have them playing, like, over the speakers as people walk through the attraction. Dude, that makes it feel legit, man. But I have yeah, a man. better surprise for you. <laughs> You're not gonna believe this. We found one. A real one. Uh, 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 gotta go, man. Uh, well, well look, it, it's in there somewhere. I'm, I'm sure you'll see it. Okay, I'll leave you with some of this great audio that I found. Talk to you later, man. Okay. Uh, hello? Hello? <laughs> Uh, Alright, he's back. Oh! as well, it's not even Freddy. What? It's a fake jump scare. Oh, it's because my fucking... Ah, no, my brain is turning off. So an well, they're so enemy. I don't know what fucking. Ugh, it's looking up. It's weird because here isn't right next to me, but it feels like it should be. So spring trap the only. Oh, 
They're gonna come along here. No? Oh, under there again? Okay, weird choice. So I think we only have to watch out for that fucking thing. It's so weird seeing them walk. Because in the original, didn't they just like kind of you know, crackle on the screen and then they would end up uh, teleporting basically? Can you fucking stop, please? Too old for this shit. Jesus Christ. There we go. This is suppository. Awesome. <laughs> oh, Jesus. It's scary. Also, it's annoying I have to keep switching to the to the night sky. Free is weird. I don't know what it is about Free. I haven't really been paying attention to him. But I think, again, it seems like it's based around just one animatronic walking around, which is kind of more doable, but I don't know how to defend against it other than closing the vent. I don't know what to do when it's too late to close the vent. You know? Yo, what up, Holmes? Uh, Waffling on, I had no idea. <gasps> okay, well, let's do some of the Halloween stuff. Let's let's end this out on me doing some of the Halloween shit and trying to understand how the fuck the Halloween stuff even works. Because I'm assuming people who've played this probably have not played the Halloween DLCs. I don't know. I'm just assuming. Uh, build a mangle, hallway, trick or treat, dread bear, danger keep out. <laughs> yeah, that's a fucking good idea. The corn maze just seems like a fucking terrifying situation. So just pirate ride, but let's do pirate ride, I guess. We'll do a couple of these. I don't know if I'll do all of them. Shoot targets. Get high score. Okay. Um. Welcome to the board, Captain Foxy's Pirate Adventure. You can help me with this here adventure by shooting the targets with that there head cannon. Do your best, or I'll send you to Davy Jones's locker. <laughs> Good luck. Keep your hands inside the ride at all times. Oh, this is fucking. Awesome. 
Oh, dude, I really don't like how dark this gets. This get it's not like dark, it's, it's like pitch black. It's like actually terrifying. Actually, that's more of a 2014 thing. right now though. What? I could not hit that. Oh, that's kind of cool. You get to see outside of the place. I really like that. Oh, fuck. Uh... God, I fucking lost, dude. Holy shit. Fuck. I feel like such a bitch, like, flinching at this, but I just know this is like a setup. It's putting you into a full sense of security, 100%. Happy birthday! Happy birthday? Okay. Yeah. Scallywag? Kiss my ass. Fucking headshot you, you little bitch. Okay. Game one, claim your prize. I'm thinking of mermaid cheek of them. Sorry about that. Keep in mind that this DLC pack is nothing more than a festive holiday themed add-on, which has absolutely no hidden intent or purpose. So, have fun. Good one, voice actor. Uh, I wanted to build a mangle. to the Fazbear Entertainment Fulfillment Center. Welcome. Today, we are assembling animatronic performers. Uh -huh. Each animatronic unit will bring joy to the children at one of our many Freddy Fazbear locations. Just place the necessary components in the assembly chute conveniently located at the front of your workstation. Each work order is unique, so gather only the components <laughs> as shown on the quad monitor array. Use the high voltage shock buttons to gently remove any unwanted critters that stumble onto the assembly line. Okay. Now, let's get to work. So I have to basically clean shit, then chuck it in here? Oh, fuck. Uh, how do I know if there's critters on it? Oh, I need... Wait, what? This is this is fucking too complicated for my brain to process. Was that a giraffe head? Give me a little one. Oh, can't get it. Well done. Let's see how you do. <laughs> fucking dog shit. What oh, no. the hell it is looks that? Like there aren't enough components. 
Perhaps the instructions were not clear. Perhaps you should seek employment elsewhere. Yeah, probably. Oh, there's... I fucking knew it. I saw you up there. I fucking knew it. Hmm. Frank and Freddy. That's more sexy than Mermaid Chica. <laughs> Let's do Danger Keep Out. Let's see what this actually is. Because... I mean, it seems like it's like a... Like a Five Nights extra game. I mean, that's literally pretty much what it is. Use light to scare animatronics. Survive until 6am. Okay. Me going to bed now? So... GA? Oh, you mean good night? Yeah, good night, dude. Have a good one. Hello? Okay. Jesus Christ, dude, this is like a seizure warning. What? No. No. What the fuck is the point of that? Oh, I guess it recharges the power, maybe? Okay. Door! Door! Dude, I wish she's sweating from how scary this shit is. What? I'm cool? How? Come on, come on, come on, come on! Just... Just fucking... Of course. I'm done for the amount of scares I can take. Keep I... in mind that this DLC pack is nothing more than a festive holiday themed add-on, oh. which has absolutely no hidden intent or purpose. So, oh, have hell. fun. Teeth Pichu? What is it, gonna pull my teeth out? That'd be an awesome candy idea. I love smacking my hand into stuff in the real world as well. It's very immersive when I'm playing VR. Uh, trick or treat? We'll do, we'll do trick or treat and dread bear, and then I'm like, I'm actually done. I d <laughs> wear mask, look through windows to see who will answer the door. Okay. Oh, please ring the bell.
These look cool, but I, d I don't know if I want to do any more. Keep in mind that this DLC pack is nothing more than a Oh, thank you, voice actor. Detail, yeah. Oh, okay. Yep. No yep. Thank you. So thank you. Thank you, Mr. Voice actor. I'm glad you told me that. I couldn't have worked that out if you didn't tell me that eight times. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Welcome back to Research and Development. Today, we are using science to pervert the mysteries of life and reanimate the inanimate. To begin, it is customary for the creator to give a melodramatic speech. Go uh, on, I'll wait. To fucking electronically shocking All done? something? Yes. Good job. Now, let's wake our little experiment with a controlled shock. Turn the crank to lower the platform, then throw the switch. This, I don't like this. Oh my god. Okay. Hey. It's alive, but lacking the necessary control module, namely the brain. So let's calibrate one. Use the laboratory tools to adjust the brain's vital characteristics. Use the blueprints as a guide for matching the correct colors, size, and neurofeedback loop. When you are satisfied, carefully place the brain in the creature's animatronic head cavity. Uh, am I eating the brain? I may have eaten your brain. I do apologize. I know, I am I do not feel too good about doing it. Yeah, you'll get it back in about seven hours. You good with that? Fucking... <clears throat> I think I may have to restart this one. Oh, it's here. reading the prompts. Yeah, th these scares ain't working on me anymore, I'm gonna be honest, I became conditioned. So I think we're good. Oh, okay. I think that's enough of this. Uh... <laughs> I mean, I can come back and play it more at some point. I don't know. I think an hour and a half worth of me playing this is, uh... It's sufficed. It's, it's sufficed any craving anyone's had to ever see me play this. Um, so yeah. Anyway. Love you guys very much. And uh, happy Halloween, I suppose. And I'll see you next time. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Oh, 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 okay. We're, we're good. Jesus Christ. I'm so sweaty right now.